Hey TikTok, welcome back to my channel. Let's see what we got going on here, okay? Let's see what we're doing here, boo. We're gonna pull from the um monology here. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What's going on with the um collective energy on TikTok here? Alrighty. Ooh, wow. So you guys are now believing in the impossible here, okay? The blue moon is here. So something could be happening, something could have happened once in a blue moon. Um, the answers you are needing are coming. Full moon and Gemini here. Can I get one more, Holy Spirit? Or two or three or four, okay? At the bottom of the deck, we got work through your fears, okay? And we have, wow, bring love into the situation, okay? New moon in Aquarius. Meditate and contemplate. New moon in Pisces. So somebody could be a Pisces, an Aquarius, a Gemini, a Leo, Okay? Confidence, wow, is your key to success here. So being confident here. And then we got emotions are truly running high with the super moon energy here. So let's see what's going on here, love. Mm. Believe in the impossible. Wow, believe in the impossible, beloved. You're going to be extremely happy here with the sun energy here. You got a lot of positive energy coming in, a lot of happiness. I feel like you're now tapping into this uh, vitality energy. And you got a lot of success and celebration coming in all as well. You have truly closed out a cycle here that was keeping you stuck for a very long time. You could have definitely been working on something here. Yeah, Queen of Swords. You could be now mastering something. What's the Queen of Swords? Yeah, wow. The devil, shadow, okay, four of pentacles. Hmm. So with the devil being here, clarifying the queen of swords, maybe you had some type of addictions here or some type of destructive behavior that you could have been holding on to and now you're doing the work on that, okay? You're releasing it. Yeah, and now the will is turning in your favor here. Beautiful. Yep, and you're going towards a new passionate beginning here. The answers you are needing are coming here. Something about some type of equal give and take reciprocity here. Something about your gifts or being fair in a situation or just living in the present moment. You got a lot of abundance coming in. You're definitely healing with the star energy here. You're being re feeling rejuvenated here. Yep, with the nine of wands, you're taking action to go after your passions here because you're going through a transformation. A lot of endings could have happened. What's the death card? Yeah. It was a lot of conflict, inner conflict when it came to this transformation. Yeah. You're now releasing these burdens here. And with the four swords, you're definitely resting and rejuvenating yourself. Okay. Emotions are running, fi uh, running fire, running high. Yep. We got the queen of cups here with the clarifier. You could be connecting with yourself at this time. Yeah, you're standing your guards here, standing your ground. Yeah, and people that were trying to come up against you or be deceptive in your energy, these secret enemies here with the moon energy, they're now feeling defeated here because you're showing yourself more self-love here. Yeah, you're investing now in yourself and you could be enjoying the fruits of your labor at this time here. You're now bringing love into a situation here. What's going on with this situation? Yeah, with the Eight of Wands, there's a lot of action being taken. Swift movement here. You could be an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius here. Or you could be dealing with one. It's some type of quick change that is taking place here. Maybe you're going to be traveling here, okay, in the near future by air. Yeah, with the Nine of Cups, this is like a wish fulfillment for you here. You're going to be living the life of luxury here, okay? And yeah, with the Three of Pentacles and the Three of Cups and the Empress. Come on now, babe. Um, you're entering into a happy time in your life at this moment. You may be reconnecting with a long-lost friend, relative, or loved one. Or you may be celebrating something important, okay, to you, okay? Um, you could have conquered some type of small goal or a big goal here. Take a hot resonate, love. Um, it's time to spend quality time with the people that is most important to you. I couldn't even get it out. 
And with the Three of Pentacles here, everything is coming together now. Yeah, for you, Empress, you're bringing love into a situation here. You're getting out of your, your logic, Queen of Swords. You're releasing this toxic behavior, addictions that you were holding on to that was doing nothing but bringing a lot of burdens onto you. You're getting more rest now, taking care of yourself better. And you you starting to look good, boo. Okay, you starting to look good, honey. It's like you a magnet now. You're you're definitely attracting the things that makes you happy. You're attracting the people that want to celebrate you and not, you know what I'm saying? Tolerate you. All right. Tell me about this meditate and contemplate here. Yep, with the Empress? Shit. The Empress here now, boo. What the Emperor doing here? They meditating, contemplating about you. Yeah, about coming towards you. They want to get on this path with you. You're embarking on something new, but you may not have a plan in place or know where you're headed, okay? You need to activate that creative restlessness somehow, but be sure to put some energy into plotting out your journey before jumping in. Find a mentor. So you may need to find a mentor at the time, or you may have a masculine energy that's coming in to be your mentor here. All right, you've been hit with a spark of inspiration now. You must figure out how to turn that fire into action here. This could be this emperor energy here with the seven of cups. This masculine energy has a lot of opportunities. They could have wishful thinking. This could be someone that's always in their head. I'm, 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 pilling, I'm picking up of a, a king of swords energy. Somebody's very logical, okay? Although they do speak the truth and they're in their power, okay? Yeah, I feel like they're coming out of that illusion here. And they're going to be taking action towards you, Empress, here. Well, okay. Yeah, judgment. Um, hmm. Yeah. You're likely close to reaching a significant stage and a journey here, okay? It's like somebody also may be going through some type of awakening here. Somebody may even want your forgiveness here. They want you to have mercy on them because they're going through a rebirth. It could be this Emperor. Yep, and they coming towards you. They tired of being left out in the cold from your energy with the five of pentacles. They want this justice, and they will be taking this leap of faith here. They're watching and spying, okay? Or well, these could be past people that's watching you, spying on you, and regret, heartbroken here, wanting to apologize now that you're in this new energy. You're loving on yourself, and it shows here. Yeah, with the high priestess, queen of wands, absolutely. You're looking real good out here, beloved. Your confidence is key to success, and people are seeing this now, and this is why you got a lot of offers that's coming in for you, and that's, okay, Ace of Swords, that's clarity, babe. That's clarity here. You got mental clarity here. It's like you got a lot of success going on. You got breakthroughs that's happening in your life. You getting new creative ideas to bring about success in your life as well. Um, you're making a decision. Somebody may be wanting to have surgery. Is going to be having surgery in the near future. Take it how it resonates. What's the Ace of Swords? Yeah, but I feel like if you are going to be having surgery in the near future, with the temperance, it's going to be okay. Everything's going to work out the way it's supposed to work out. You're, you're going to come out okay, okay? Um, I feel like a lot of you guys are definitely now knowing your purpose here. You've been patient, and you're just operating in moderation. You're not doing too much, too less here. Yeah. Something about a two of cups with a king of swords is somebody could be juggling here. You could have found out that somebody was juggling you, that they invested in a situation, a family dynamic, and now they're not having any type of victory and success with the six of wands in reverse. This could have been somebody that was very egotistic here. We got a king of cups here from your past, or you have a past life with this person. It's like they want to move forward with you here. Yeah, they could have been in hermit mode here. This person is manifesting some type of marriage or something like that with you. But they could be all in her head dealing with a lot of fear. Because this could have been somebody that disappointed you or abandoned you or walked away from you. Yeah, with the tower, it was a sudden change when they did this. It's like whenever this person here from your past walked away, whether it was family, friends, whatever, and you took that same love that you was pouring into these friends, family, whoever, however, honey, you a totally different person here. Your energy is so different. Your, your speech is different at this time here. And with the Page of Pentacles, you're truly manifesting here, okay? Um, new financial opportunities here. I feel like your faith was definitely tested. And with the Four of Wands, you got celebrations coming in. Harmony, joy, freedom, creativity. And we got that Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles energy here. So you definitely in the bag at this time right now, beloved. I'm hearing you showing the world the real you. <laughs> They getting to see the real you, beloved. 
Yeah, you are protected here. Come on now, spirit. I like it. Beautiful read here. 